Did you know the same piece of plutonium killed two brilliant scientists in the most horrifying way possible? August 1945, Los Alamos Laboratory. Physicist Harry Daglian was working alone late at night. He was conducting routine experiments with a sphere of plutonium, part of the Manhattan Project's final tests. Nuclear research had become almost mundane by then. Scientists handled radioactive materials daily, but as Daglian moved the tungsten carbide brick closer to the core, his hand slipped. The brick fell directly onto the plutonium sphere. Instantly, a brilliant blue flash filled the room. The core had gone critical. He frantically knocked the brick away, but it was too late. The invisible damage was done. 25 days later, he died from radiation poisoning. Nine months later, physicist Louis Slotin was demonstrating the same core to colleagues. Using only a screwdriver to keep two plutonium hemispheres apart, his hand slipped. Another blue flash, another lethal dose. The demon core had claimed its second victim.